Release Naira Mali right now and arrest Mobad wife Wumi. Hey, hey, this word is coming from Mobad's father, his mother, auntie, and Naira Mali sister. As police tries to move U turn to arrest Mobad's wife over recent allegations of poisoning Mobad and taking over his properties. If you don't know, you know now this case is something else. I swear to God, this issue is something else. But we are here to unfold anything that is happening to you all on Lost TV Media. So, coming from Naira Mali, alleged sister, Wumi, over Wumi issue, she said, Keeping Naira Mali in custody to appease social media is bad. That is Shubomi. She said this, alleged Naira Mali sister. Yes. So she wrote, keeping someone who willingly traveled back to help in detention for nearly 30 days with no charge, no evidence, no sufficient witness is a violation of human rights. Keeping him in custody to appease social media and the internet mob is crazy. If you have evidence against him for anything he's been accused of, charge him but if you don't release him it shouldn't take this long for the investigation to be done we all want the truth we all want justice what is the delay we have already lost one person trying to lynch another is not going to bring about justice i pray nobody experience being accused of atrocities you have no hand in god is in control hashtag free naira mali after this post by naira mali alleged sister shubomi now something else happened let me show you as you can see this is Mobad's auntie he's accusing and pointing finger at the wife Wumi. that is late Mobad's wife Wumi. ha who has a son for him called liam now he's accusing fingers on him and you can see that she's saying something so i'll play the video now and then if you are not yoruba please kindly wait i will translate it as the video is rolling too so let's watch the video roll it Umi, Umi, she offers of me people go around see Baba Mubari so ni pay iron. Show my pay that I was there no. Mubi I want change. See Mubi I want see Mubi Umi I just go to buy. Oh my people send to Biye Nero. I am okay okay. Kuti ya. I go buy ya. I am okay. No so pay no go. Umi, show you talk about Baba ni Mubi Mubi. Oh ni lost cost you. Then you all lie just on one car in Asimu Mubi. Oh you all don't Baba me fit there. Oh, Jack, I lose so much. To me, this is a good one. Oh, me, so I'm not yet. I'm not even one day. I'm not even going to be able to do the panic. Oh, what you need to confess to me called that. I'm going to go. I can't go in Brooklyn. I don't go there. 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 Back to the translation of the video, she said, Wumi, Wumi, do you want to tell me everything Mobad's dad said about you are lies? Do you remember when we came there? I saw blood stained clothes and I was asking my sister how they came about. Who decided not to question you because we felt you were mourning? But know this if you are involved in Mobad's death, you will not go scot free. Yes. You will look at the blood relation between Mobad and I to judge you. You made us lose that boy. I am not accusing you yet. And I am not saying Naira Mali and Samrari are not involved. But there is a definitely an internal issue. I have things to say to you and the people you are in cohorts with because this loss pains me differently. You will not go free if you are involved. As you can understand what she was saying in Yoruba. Now, that's not all though. Mobad Father said his own. Let me show you. As you can see on your screen, this is Mobad Father saying many things about Wumi, the wife of Mobad. I will leave you to watch it. And he even came to Mobad's house this morning, 29th of October, to come and drop a song that if the song is dropped inside Mobad's house, the song will bring up justice. It will be hitting on the ear of the person that killed Mobad in that house. So he came to Mobad's house in Lagos Island to drop a song in front of the wife Wumi, accusing her of everything. I will still show you. Roll it. <laughs> I'm 
Aye mama ti fi n pa mi lefun. Won ti joju imole ninu aye. Won mama tu fe joku e o Olorun. Ah, eni mo ni mi eni o mo la ta. Eh, wa ko wa ro mi lowo. Aye ma ba yeye mi. Wa ko wa gbe ja mi ja o. Wa ko wa ro mi lowo o. Eni mo ni mi eni o people i'm saying it now i'm still repeating it they irritate the whole thing that this guy have i'm a carpenter i i deal with the people used to give me contract of say okay build this house do this my son did not see me in that way he can prefer to give to his in-laws that maybe that one is a police police officer and he gave me to go and buy land do this do that so yeah, he, all, all what is happened is beyond natural. That's the reason why I ate ah. And I made mention sure something on the three days ago on the court that whenever this girl wants to go and fuck ranch, she will give, he will had something to endo me to cook for my son and slept up. And from there, we enter another person's room in that Malian house another person and it was later sleep with someone there it was later that person that you go and meet is now girlfriend now meet her there that is the person that revealed that secret to mo and mo told me you know i cannot even tell him that you go and scare your wife away so that you can still manage it but i know this is beyond natural that was this a day that I decided to let okay I will take you out of this place. When I take him out of the place, I now say, okay, you follow me to a Kurodu, and he follow me. Could you believe the second day is the one that I even tests that guy, the address of where I put him, and I know this is beyond my power. I try my best. So the character of that guy make me to ah. Uh, hello? Are you clear now? Sir, thank you for answering. Hello? Hello? So, you are loud and clear, sir. Yeah. Any thank other you, question? Um, the other yeah. question says, what about mobile phone? Is he under police custody for investigation? Um, it's in the mortuary now, at Yaba. Phone, phone. Okay, okay, phone. You mean phone? Yes, phone. Hello? Yes, okay, his phone. His phone. Yeah. Uh, it's, I'm sure it's going to be with the police now. They collect from women now to police people to handle it. Okay. Um, last uh -huh. uh, comment section before I speak. Um, there is a problem that most of us are trying to understand, which is is Wumi and Mobad married legally or traditionally? Uh, they marry traditionally even the day they just call me they say they want to do an introduction could you believe it's only me and one of my sisters that attend the, the the marriage because it's not really marriage i i call it introduction that is my aim but i was too shocked on the day that i met there they said they want to do and do engagement traditional engagement but i met a lot of people when i read the in the event center and uh, could you believe on our way going we carry the dj that's going to perform there before we reach there we meet another dj see because this girl is the one that control the whole money so he arranged a lot of people drinking i will not ask myself it's not the introduction that you want to come and do here they now turn it to engagement fine i was there so they just do a traditional engagement so that's it okay baba baba african tv baba question here yes, is sir. a very legal question question here is very legal mofeke were very precise did you or mobad yes, did you guys pay dowry to wumi's family in a in a yoruba yes you know yoruba you know you know when there is a wedding different from knocking on the door yeah. mommy is different yeah. from marriage 
Did you guys, did your family pay dowry to Mumi's mother or father yes. for marriage? Yes. Yes. They, they, so you guys we paid. paid? We paid. paid. Okay, yeah. so that means they paid. are traditionally married. That means they are traditionally married. Yeah, they are traditionally married. I need to married. clear that. Yes. Okay, Baba, when you're yes. talking, because of the social media, please don't use words like hate. Don't use those uh, mm. words like you hate or anything okay. that is. Okay. Yeah, try to be diplomatic. Okay, maybe we we'll okay. take two more questions. Okay. okay. We we'll take two more questions and then we can let him go. Please. Okay. Two more questions. That means that something is, he has skeleton in combo that is hiding. So I don't know what making make us scared. I don't know. I myself okay. am expecting something like that, which is good. Under most, we must do it. Okay, sir. So Nobody see my son. Sir, sir, one son. Yeah. Okay, sir. The second question is that. Uh -huh. Sir, what about the CCTV, sir? What happened to the CCTV? The CCTV. I, 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 I was surprised when they said the CCTV is not working. No, I'm not living with them. If their own is not working, what about the person that is beside the right? and the left and the street hmm. they can tap from those ones if they want real justice which people are crying okay what about the street they will know how they pass they are living in a, in a very um a very um, well okay place at estate in highland there if their own is not working what about the right and the left i'm sure those ones will be working outside Except they, they cannot even see what is happening inside, but they will see what is happening in the compound. But they want to carry him go. So that's that's the TV camera with dictate and it will tell us exactly what happened. They did not they did not cover those things. So I don't know what is happened there. I don't know what is happened. I don't know whether they are hiding it or not. I don't know. Okay. So what, I that's enough. One more that. one more question. One more question, then I'll, no, I'll this round up the questions. I'll be I'll be sure I'll be question. Okay, so the last question. What about the white clothes we missed uh, throwing to the uh, the grave, Mobile's grave, the white clothes? Mm, that white clothes, I, um, I wasn't there. But I didn't know the interpretation of that cloth. But people that know, they, they said that cloth means a lot. Uh, let me just use this uh, proof whether you you will understand it. They said, by giving that kind of a cloth, throw into that uh, grave, means that I've clothed you. I've clothed you. Don't come and expose me. Can you hear that language? Now, motifiashu I cover you with this cloth. Don't come and hmm. expose me. And I was covered also. So, it says, just form of a proverb. That's how people interpret that thing. But I wasn't on that line. I didn't know much. But people of Yoruba they say, ah, but if you are sure, you will go more at two minutes. You will go and see how God works. And who knows that they are going to see uh, they will re re remove him from that place. See how God works. Thank you. I go by the name Black Mamba. Don't forget, I thank God for my subscribers, my phone, and my sub. If you like, if you comment, if you subscribe, I'll keep thanking God for you. I love you all.